everyone welcome back to my channel so today I am filming in my bathroom because it is late um, I've been really busy lately uh, my grandma just had knee replacement surgery so I've kind of been helping her out lately so that is why I am posting so late um, and also the lighting when I've been doing it in daylight has not been so great so I figured I would come down here change the background up a little bit change my setup just for um, a couple videos and then of course go back to the regular one once the um, bad weather here has kind of left us. So this brow is all messed up. Um, today I'm doing a really simple cat eye look and is actually inspired by the two cats from Lady and the Tramp, Sai and Am. So I am going to get started with this really quick and classic look. So I moved closer so you can see. And I'm going to start with my eyes. I already have my face and brows done. Hopefully the camera, it seems like when I put my hands up, it's kind of doing some things. So hopefully it, it will stop that. Um, I'm going to focus and lock it in. Okay, so I am going to start with the Wild and Alluring palette from BH Cosmetics. I'm gonna take this kind of yellowy green color here I am just taking a flat brush and I'm going to pack this on the lid. It comes off nice and gold when you swatch it. So you can kind of see when I blend it, like the greens and oranges don't really pop out once you have swatched it a bit so i'm just packing this on with a brush of course you can use this wet if you want a different intensity for your gold um if you wet these like if you wet your brush with some fix plus or some setting spray they become like liquid metal almost and they look really cool okay so now I'm taking a shimmery black shadow this is called Chaco I'm sorry not black uh brown and this is from Toki Doki I'm gonna take a fluffy brush here and you're gonna start by building it out on the outer V and then bringing it back into the corner this way you can blend it out over your brow just like this but also create a really classic just nice shaded shape i'm sorry if you can hear people walking around in the background but you can darken this up i'm gonna layer it up a couple times and there you can see it's kind of bronzy and gold I'm just gonna blend this out a little bit more and you can bring it out like I do out to here or you can keep it real simple and keep it really in or you can smoke it out even more depending on how dramatic you want it to look now we're going to take some liquid liner you can use a brown liquid liner if you wish um, but I don't have one so I'm going to use black I have a little bit of fallout there but I'm just going to create a cat eye So of course, create your wing the whole way across. So you want a nice sharp wing and then on the inner corner, you're going to do that cat like V shape and I kind of smudged it on the bottom but we will fix that that is why you keep q-tips at your disposal so you can just clean it right up okay and that is how I do that side now I'm gonna do the other side and then I'll come right back Okay, so now I am going to 
take some mascara and really coat the lashes so they are big and kind of the mascara I need right now is that um cat eye colossal or whatever from I think you know y'all know what I'm talking about it's yellow and it has like cheetah print on it that would be perfect for this but I do not have that today so I am just using a volumizing one any one you have will do for my face I'm going back in the wild and alluring palette and I'm going to use the bronzer they have here with a angled brush And it is a shimmery bronzer, but I'm going to contour a little bit. With it, it's actually pretty nice. Then I'm going in with the blush that they have in this palette as well. It's a baked blush, just like the rest of the palette. But it's a nice light shimmery pink, and I'm just going to swirl this into the cheek. So it will be like a highlight blush combo blend it out a little bit why is my phone going off jesus for my oh that's a little strong on this side isn't it um why in this lighting is this blush so strong so now i'm going to use a kind of nudish lip gloss this is called whipped vanilla and it's from Liplicious. This is what they used to carry in Bath and Body Works. Um, they still do in some, but Whipped Vanilla is one of my favorites. If you don't like sticky lip gloss, you will hate these. Alrighty. So this is the end of the look. It's just a really classic old style look. Um, the cat eye is really dramatic, it really makes your eyes pop no matter what color they are, and it really just brings a lot of focus to right here in your face. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. I will be back tomorrow with another video for you guys. So make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe so you don't miss anything. So I will see you next time, and bye!